as you guys saw, Sony A7 III, I just bought it. I'm scared because it's going to be a big learning curve for me. I've shot everything through Nikon, started with D3500, moved on past that, bought the Nikon Z50. Recently, I just did a senior senior session with this camera and did great. I loved it. I'm still getting good footage, good images on this camera. No matter of fact, I'm using it to record this video right now. And yeah, um, just getting you a little bit of update, I guess. Oh, speaking of, ta-da! Ooh, look at that. I'm very excited. I have the the kit lens. I have the 28 to 70 millimeter 3.5 f-stop i guess and then i i bought the sony 50 millimeter 1.8 and i'm gonna be using that through my portraits portrait photography so and as well i'm gonna be using that for whatever i guess it is gonna be my main camera now and it is gonna be my backup camera so i'm very excited for that so yeah Whoa, 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 back up. I didn't give you a reason why I bought the Sony a7 III. The reason why is because 24 megapixel and 4K24. Come on. As a 2018 camera, it shoots 4K24. It's a hybrid camera. Like, Nikon Z50, I mean, my Nikon Z50 can't even compete. Like, this is a full-frame camera. This is... The Nikon Z50 is legit a crop sensor. I hate it because there's no IBIS on it. IBIS means in-body stabilization. Yeah, i very excited. So with that being said, I'm just here to tell you that I just bought a new camera and show you my good B-roll I just shot and rant about Nikon Z50 not being a, the camera, not being the camera that I wanted. So, yeah. Um, you're going to be expecting more of me here with the Sony a7 III and Nikon Z50 as my cameras, I guess. So, I'm excited. That was itchy, so, sorry. And three, two, one, deuces.